back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved Mobile. Today we return boys and girls. Ladies and gentlemen, guys, I'm your fan for your test today the most amazing variety. We got a free gift! We got an apprentice bike! Dude! This is actually perfect! I was gonna like literally try to craft up a pike because we needed a better weapon because we're out here trying to hunt somebody's raptors up and well an apprentice pike will make our lives a hell of a lot easier. Oh we got a blueprint for it. Okay that makes a little bit more sense. Dang! That's slightly more disappointing. But anyways, I hope you guys have a fan for today today. Most amazing variety. We are back. If you guys are doing a playlist down below and catch up on the series thus far. And make sure you subscribe to the notification bell. Hit to stay up to date with the series as it does come out today. I want to start today off actually focusing upon one of these new things that we just unlocked. The outpost that we can purchase for a measly 10 amber. Only a small dent in the supply that we have at hand. And then I wanted to actually see what this is like and see what it will entail over here i'm guessing it's gonna be a similar size to pretty much the rest of these yeah we can continue kind of decking these out is that a dillo about to attack me oh that's not a dillo about to attack me we can put that down and bada big bada boom an outpost awaits for you we can get 200 slips out of it whatever that means and oh my god some of these things actually cost a lot of slips how much is it for some of these slips 500 for 20 200 for 10 hmm Okay, so that's kind of weird that we start out with less, but there is a wide variety of things that we can purchase here, including a journeyman. Oh, give me that journeyman bike, boy. If I can't have the one that I was about to have anyway, I'll take me one of these. We still got 100 slips, and I don't want to go too crazy on those things, but definitely let's start things out with a nice little pike that'll uh, make our raptor hunting a hell of a lot easier, including other quests that we may venture off onto. We've got a good amount of food. We'll be able to get a good amount of hydration. I think without further ado, we are ready to venture out a little bit. But I hope you guys are having an awesome day of the most amazing variety. I am just so happy that we finally got some great weaponry to help us out with. Hopefully, we might even partake in some taming today as well, although we will have to see. I'd love to get me a raptor once we potentially finish this quest lineup. I think we should be able to get those trank arrows crafted up. We got some narcotics. We got some arrows. Maybe we'll even invest. Ooh. We could use a hundred of the rest of our slips, or maybe even a little bit of amber. Try to get ourselves that crossbow and see how we can start applying that to certain situations. Yeah? Yeah? Anyways, this location over here is starting to get a wee bit on the dangerous side. Hopefully, we don't come across a pack of raptors. That'd be, without a doubt, the most horrifying thing that could happen to us. Hopefully, it's just a YOLO, YOLO type of guy. One single one that we can handle relatively well. I think the pike should be a huge boost, but... For now, we must stay on the hunt. We must stay vigilant, and we must be prepared for the unexpected. I was about to say the unprepared, then I'm like, wait a minute, that's us. <laughs> King of the unprepared here. I'm hearing big things getting toppled. Where is this at? See, I don't want to swap out the map, because I'm horrified of what might happen. What is that freaking parasaur out here looking like a Skyrim horse? Hot dog. It's starting to boop and beep a little bit, but... Mm, where is you at? If this doesn't keep on... Oh. Oh, I see him. I see him. Oh, I think I might have seen a couple. Oh, we got bugs and stuff, too. Yo, st step step aside, bugs. This is getting to be a relatively sketchy area. I definitely saw one. Oh, we don't... Mm, I don't know if we want to get swarmed by two of those at a time. Also, don't you dare come at me, uh, freaking bug broskies. Uh, why don't I see if we can snipe him a little bit here with our journeyman bow? Maybe Kobe. I need you to stop moving there, though, my good sir. Oh, doink, we got him, we got him. Over to the Journeyman Pike we go. I hope you guys are ready for bats. Oh, no, he's he seems to, is he coming? Is he, Did we hit him even? I don't know, but he's wandering away from the other raptor who's definitely slow at the top of the hill, so it's raptor hunting time, baby. Oh, it's not raptor hunting time, baby. Oh my God, I'm happy I didn't just dive into that. Oh, they're diving into me though. This is no, 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 no. Okay, we should. Oh my God, it's mate boosted. Ah, that's not a that's that's a bad sign. They got reinforcements coming. It's still mate boosted. There's more. Oh my God, Billy Mays here. Not the time for Billy Mays here though. Where's the lat? Oh, he's over there. He's hunting. He's on the hunt. Oh my. Oh yeah. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna get the jump on them before they get the jump on me. As soon as this parasaur dies, let's go. They're distracted by the parasaur. Parasaur, you're doing God's work, baby. You letting me come out of this old top. Oh, what is this nice hunt? Here's a saddle. Dude, we got a... Oh, oh, I thought that was another raptor. We just got a raptor saddle from our quest. And, and some dope goods. Another pike. Let's get it, dude. 
Things are going well over here. Ooh, things are going well in the Papa Star household uh, for now. And of course, we do have all of the loot. The bugs did go ahead and eat them up, which is unfortunate for us, but there's still a lot of goods that these things are dropping. I guess we could try and kill the bugs really quick. Like, what's the worst that could happen? Right? There's only so many bugs. They, they don't seem too angry. I don't think they're flying at me. Or if they are, they're flying super slow. What a bug. Come at me, bro. There we go. Another one down. Another one bites the dust. But do, do, do. Get over here, dragonfly. All right. I guess he doesn't want to be part of the music video. Uh, I guess we could loot these guys up for their chitin and whatnot. That's always a great thing to get out of them since chitin. I mean, it's a relatively specialized thing. We do need to, for the most part, get it from bugs. So, listen, if we got free bugs... Free bug's a free bug. I'm going to capitalize upon any such opportunity. Where's that other bag? There you at. Bag number two. What you got in store for me? Mm, nothing that's super great. But when in Rome, while out here... Ooh, we got some levels too. Where are we going to want to apply these points to? Why don't we do some... A little bit more in stamina here. I want to get my stamina up to a solid... I'm thinking like 200 is going to be a good number for stamina. We got a lot of engrams to work with. And ooh, pro hunt. No bola better run dear god i don't even want to know what type of hunt that is or maybe at the very least let's start this up what type of what type of thing is this Ooh, our bell is starting to grumble a little bit out of lads let's get some food in her as well make sure it all's going well 200 meters that way 10 carnos oh my goodness gracious we're gonna need a little bit of a pause from hunting carnos i don't think we're quite at that point yet maybe we are i mean this is a good melee weapon we got but why don't we go to the south of the island? I think... Oh, man, that's a kilometer. Kilometer that way. Uh, I guess we... Uh, listen, it, it's got to happen eventually. We can kill ourselves a couple more raptors along the way. Maybe... I was going to say maybe tame one. Never mind. He, had to, he, he just decided he had to start running at me. Or, before we head out on this adventure, why don't we try and maybe get a tame done? Maybe make sure that we become a little bit more well prepared, you know? And... Ooh, dude, all these raptors are dropping such juicy goods. I forgot they're like walking treasure chests. <gasps> Theobia! I've only seen like one of you guys so far. It's been a minute. Um, okie dokie though. I'm guessing we do have arrows on us. Do we have any trank? We have a single, a single arrow, the trank. So we're not going to want that. We're going to want to head on over here, acquire some narcotics back from home, back from safety. And then honestly, I'm kind of down to potentially go a little bit balls to the wall or mm, see, I don't want to start the Carno hunt because I think once we start it, like we have to finish. Is that a Raptor over there? Yo, yo, yo. Ooh. Let's, uh, do you guys <laughs> want to try and tame a Spino? Honestly? Oh my God. If we, if we manage to go to Spino, now that I think about it this early game, dear God, I, mm, mm, I mean, if we make a good crossbow and you know, why don't we, why don't we play this by ear? We're going to go home. We're going to see how we can equip this. And maybe we're, maybe we'll walk out of here with a new Spino. If not, I'm cool with like a new Raptor too, though. But listen, a Spino, dear God, now that you bring it up, it's just so casually out of nowhere. I'd love me one, especially because I think he's kind of close to my house and I don't want a Spino near my house. Uh, I wouldn't say he's that close, actually. I guess, I guess we are a little wee bit. Ooh, an egg. Okay, this is the egg de tortal. Well, how many turtles we got nearby? Because whoever laid this thing is about to not be amused with me. And that's my egg now. And, oh, look at that. No one's even that mad. No, no, turtle got mad. Turtle got mad. I'll back it up, back it up. Good news is that that Spino... Oh, no, no, no. Let's not stop sprinting. The good news is, is that the Spino is definitely not close to our base at all. So I am not at all worried upon any of that type of jazz. I'd love to get me a Dodo egg. Hey, Dodo! You lay yourself an egg quite yet. I am in desperate need of one for scientific reasons that turtle will he, he's chugging we might have to deal with them in about 10 minutes or so for now what i gotta deal with is a little bit oh how did i even do that you what me i don't even know what what just happened how did i how did i just switch my view i wasn't even trying to do that i was just trying to kind of jump up a little bit yeah dude par parkour is not a strong suit of mobile arc i tell you what it's just uh it's, yeah, look at this. I'm just, I'm trying to use two fingers on the left side to jump up. That's just not happening. You know, okay, okay. Here's, here's what we're going to do. <gasps> Yet. Dang it. All right. Well, the turtle is almost a threat as well. So we, I guess, might as well deal with the turtle first. We just got to stab him a lot. I mean, we got a pike, I think. Oh, is there two turtles? 
Dear God, there are two turtles angrily scuttling towards us. Good news is we can see their health bars, so at least... Oh, yeah. You scared now, Mr. Turtle. I got a good weapon on my hands. Oh, you don't want none of this. You don't want none of this, Garbonemus. Did the other one scuttle away once he saw the damage I could do? Oh, he's scuttling. He's scuttling. That's what you get if you don't mess with the star unless you're ready for the supernova that will accompany. I'm still kind of scared that, that that turtle might come back, though. See, because we did take an egg, and taking eggs from enemies, or taking eggs from dinosaurs, is the cardinal sin of art. At least towards them. Like, they're not... Ha like, even, he's still scuttling away, so I don't know. But okay, Mr. Dodo, if you laid that egg that I've heard oh so much about... Um, but oh, there might be an egg. Or just poop. I seriously... Oh, it's an egg! Okay, we might finally be able to get this quest done! Escada! That's what I like to see. Yeah, let me know in the comment section as well what you guys would like to see me do in-game. Any particular teams you might want to see me going after that type of stuff. Definitely hit that like button if you are. God dang it. I hate I hate when I accidentally jump when I don't mean to. But uh, definitely let me know that you are enjoying the series that way and that you do want to see Mo. But let's begin the fresh breakfast. Oh, oi, 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 oi. Now we need a rocket carrot which can be found in a jungle fern so this hunt needs to begin again luckily we got a lot of jungle ferns nearby and like they are labeled and stuff so it does make life easier they're kind of from what i've noticed they are like the darkest root so i'm just gonna go ahead collect from this uh murder myself a hello dillo hello hello don't mind me i'm just gonna uh, stab you real quick hit you with the one two come at me See, the fact that I took out half of his health with one hit, if someone hit me like that, dude, I'd be running away just like a scared little boy. All right, I would not be sticking around for any of that. I want to collect you. See, why do you swing at an item cache when you click it once? I feel like no one's freaking trying to chop down an item cache. Like, I feel like, I don't know, man. The controls are weird to get used to, but it's mobile. They got to they gotta make it interesting because mobile isn't the most uh, conventional of arc gameplay methods since it kind of did start and grow and so much of it happened straight up on pc it's actually kind of crazy to think how well they were able to adapt it to mobile but i'm gonna get to looking for them jump oh we got another one but is this the jungle fern right hello is this not is this not exi oh there there we go yeah okay so apparently i wasn't looking at it right i'm gonna continue collecting these until we do get that one rock carrot and i'll talk to y'all in a bit Hey, there's the rock carrot. All we gotta do is fill a water skin. Ooh, we definitely gotta craft one of those first. I'm surprised that wasn't a requirement for the quest. Shouldn't be too hard, especially with all the hide that we've been gathering throughout today. All we gotta do is find where the dang thing... Oh, there it is. Oh, I already did learn it. Never mind. I guess I'm a dingus. Let's get ourselves one of those. I'll toss it probably in the hot bar. While we're here, might as well make a little bit of a uh, hot bar fixer uppers. Just kind of fix things up there. Can I move this over a couple slots and... All in all, still looking good. Still looking good. We got our hands. The... I, I was about to call that. That thing does 8 damage? What in tarnation? How much damage does this do? 77! Does not have the durability I was hoping for, but still. Ooh, how about that crossbow? I wonder if we can make trank arrows just flat out over here. But let's bring that water skin over to the inventory. I'm not entirely sure how it works. I'm guessing maybe what we got to do is switch over to it and just click when we're... Uh, in the water or maybe just kind of oh no yeah you just gotta over scroll over to it all right go to a cooking pot i don't think we have crafted one of those quite yet so that's another thing i don't know why that i was trying to hit my own inventory game get us to the crafting recipes was gonna take to get one of those in my possession a lot more stone a little bit more flint I think that we should have the stone lying around, honestly, but we might need to hit a rock a couple of times. Get that flint. It's like three flint. It's not going to be a big deal. Like, bada bing, bada boom. Three flint right there. We're up to five. Looking marvelous. And I think we're actually going to craft up kibble through this recipe. So that's exciting because I, I... Dude, it's been a while, like I said, so I've totally forgotten what dodo kibble goes towards, but... I feel like it's promising, and maybe it'll lead us to a super easy-peasy first good team. Don't get me wrong, Dodo. I love you up there, all right? But we got to start getting some helpful animals. You're, you're super helpful. You are a great moral support, and I love your clucks. You got the best clucks in the entire... Dodo clucks, that is, in the entire galaxy. I'm guessing the galaxy, because, dude, the, like, the arc story starts getting pretty crazy. There's probably Dodos all across the galaxy or something, across all these arcs. But you, wherever you might be on this roof... Or the king of clucks. But right now, I need to... This might sound weird. I am cooking your egg. I hope you aren't too mad. Let's get to placing. 
and oh i was about to say i can't put this inside like you what mate nope is gonna fit right on inside and then we got to cook the dodo kibble what do we need for the dodo kibble i believe that basic recipe is right there juan dodo egg if i accidentally ate that somehow i'd be salty uh what else do we need juan dodo egg one racket two measure berries uh, we have oh baby we got a lot more than two but check it out we can bring over a nice and even two hopefully that doesn't spoil while it's in there Ooh, hopefully that rock hair doesn't spoil now that i think about it we're on a timer and we need three fibers submerge and water uh, to submerge in water, we should be able to... Where's my water skin? Do I need to take it off the hot bar? Oh, don't tell me I gotta take it off the hot bar. Really? Really? Alright, we gotta take it off the hot bar to bring it over to the cooking pot. That's interesting. Oh, come on, man. I'm not trying to chop down my pot. I just want to access it. Like, it's a little bit inconsistent because some things you tap and you go in, other things you gotta hold. I feel like that's maybe something that they should try to improve on, is making it... A bit more consistent but okay so we got the dodo egg we got to get some cooked meat up in a hither as well let's just bring over the one that is needed for no not zero <laughs> that's that's not really a recipe at that point let's get one and do we have everything so we got the dodo egg we got the meat we got the rock hair two mezzos three fiber and then submerge it all in zavata oh we got more than three but we can put three on over and we can probably toss on all the wood we got and i don't know how long it's gonna take but let's let's get to cooking uh are we gucci You've been given a recipe place the ingredients into the pot light the fire and cook the kibble it's looking like something's gonna be nice and chefed up within uh 20 seconds give or take why is it telling me Oh, I thought that said two miles that way for a second. No, it's literally pointing me towards the fire. I was about to say, there's a campfire two miles that way. Nah, nah, the campfire is right here. The campfire is where the home is. It's where the heart is. And the heart is where the home is, according to some other cheesy metaphor or something. I don't know. Home's pretty dope, though. It gave me a little bit of that. That's some Dodo Kibble coming our way. And another completed pursuit. Ooh, pursuit now available. A raptor bait is this for the taming of a raptor i'm interested in getting a raptor tamed up obtain an egg to easily tame an at to easily tame a raptor you need the kibble made from parasaur eggs a track of parasaurs and find an egg Ooh, this is getting us ready to make some raptor kibble and have one of those tamed up ooh, ooh, ooh. i don't know if we want to go on this one for the time being because it's not like have that's the thing i like having pursuits on that actually point us towards the direction of things and currently, I mean, the only pursuits we got left, none of them are really that close to home anymore, at least in terms of directions. The Carno one, I just want to be a bit more prepared for that. We got the Raptor, which again, we just got to find some random Parasaur kibble. I, we might, oh mama, it is dark out. No, just close the door. Uh, so we can look, oh my God, we got a, is there an ant, is there a trike nearby? I just don't want to anger whatever trike laid this, but excuse me while I eat a little bit of that. Uh, let's hope that there's not a trike ready to eat my brains because, oh, well, oh, 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 there's the trike. He's not happy. He stripped me naked. Oh my God. He's freaking pushing. But so am I. There better not be a Papa trike too. All right. One trike's enough. I was, I was thinking of taming that trike eventually. I guess not. Oh my God. This dodo's going to feast on its remains. That's a hardcore dodo over there. I gotta give him that. But let's get to collecting the carrots and get to collecting the hot. I suppose the meat can come as well. And let's get that guy the hell out of our lives. And let's get the outpost into our lives and see. Uh, let's, let's take a bit of a closer look. See what we can get here. So I guess we can make some of the fishing stuff. Actually, an ascended fishing rod. Hot dog. That's insane. Freaking scuba gear. If we get high enough level so it does look like some things do have level restrictions good to know a silencer attachment can we flat out craft a gun here i don't think so we can get a beehive though yo we can get a beehive dude that's dope doesn't that technically count as a queen bee too bro if i could get a free queen bee well not necessarily free it's gonna take 100 slips but still yeah level 39 i'm looking forward to hitting you up baby oh my god that chain bola too but why don't we try and upgrade to the crossbow it is gonna cost us 70 slips and why is the oh that's a journeyman sickle i still don't get ah uh, okay never mind i guess it's good for getting prime fish too i never knew that was a thing journeyman oh my god this thing's 20 slips uh yes please sure dude a journeyman metal pick for 20 
I'll take that to the bank. I don't know what you're on where you're freaking giving me. That's a steal compared to the 70 for the hatchet. Let's go. I think we got some pretty good usage out of here. We got some pretty nice upgrades available. Don't know how much more we're going to be buying in terms of slips for this, but who knows? At the very least, I definitely, my goal, I think at the end of this is to get at least all of these stations you guys are seeing here, at least all of them down once and at least use the slips and whatnot that come available with. It's like slips, I guess here. It's not slips. What is it on here? Probably cuts. Yeah, like 280 cuts. Like, use those. Just kind of mess around with things. Make our lives easier. But I don't know how hardcore we're going to be, like, buying more cuts and stuff. Or, like, more chisels. Or, like, more more slips. I don't understand what slips are, but so be it. If it makes sense to you, that's cool. Oh, we do got a level as well. Let's get to applying that. Let's get our stamina over to a nice 190. And then I think if we just start leveling up other stuff, our stamina will go up by, like, one each level. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think besides the stat that you level up, every other stat does go up a little bit. We're capped at 50 tames total. Oh, ooh, I totally forgot about that. Guess we got to be a little bit strategic, but no biggie on that. But yeah, in terms of that Trank Arrow question, it does not look like Trank Arrows are something we can acquire from the outpost. But that is A-OK -okay because it maybe will be available in something else like... Uh, the tannery? Mm, I don't know if really the tannery. Metal foundry. Ooh, metal foundry. Seen. <laughs> metal foundry's expensive, though. Hot dog. Same with the factory. But uh, I guess those are some roads that we can cross, or bridges we can cross whenever the time comes. For now, we ain't even exactly that level, so it doesn't matter. Nothing but that is just stuff for the future. What I'd want to start off doing... Hey, where's my freaking narcotics at? I thought... Oh, are they still in the mortar and pistol? I think I just never took them out. Hey, give me some of them narcotics over there so we can make some trank arrows. And thank you to this. We actually have a nice little variety here. This is something I wasn't expected to have access to already, but so be it, man. If we got it, we got it. We got two ranged weapons and a very powerful melee weapon here to start out with. It does have durability, though, that we need to keep an eye on, and it doesn't look like the crazy durability but these two on the other hand are doing good and the damage of the crud dear god that's at least like 50 percent higher yo i like what i see out of you let's go ahead and get rid of that axe and let's put in our better axe that we have access to all 140 swings of it hopefully I don't know maybe we'll spend a little bit of amber so we can acquire the journeyman metal hatchet just to kind of make our lives easier here going forward but let's definitely get to putting some of these valuables away so we don't accidentally eat them as is tradition we got a nice little variety here of eggs we got a moss cops egg we got a carbonemus a, a turtle egg two of them and a trike egg we're gonna be able whenever we find them recipes man there's gonna be some nice kibble coming our way i guess we got these things what do these do are these anything or like what, what do we do with this? It says, like, required Amber 7. Take to a reviver. Oh, what? Take to a revival platform to convert creature essence into a new body? What? What is a revival? Hold, hold door, hold door, hold door, hold door, hold door. Is that something that we can, like, get revive? Revi oh, this is, this is hard. Revival. I don't know why revival is so hard. I Unless I spelled it wrong, which, let's be honest, I probably did. Uh... A revival platform, you say? Is that the obelisks, like, in the distance? The giant glowy things? Are those things the quote-unquote revival platforms? If any of you guys know, please, let's bless everyone with this information. Because I just realized, I just kind of finally read up on the freaking implants. And I had no clue that that was going to be a thing. But, okay, what I do know is going to be a thing is trank arrows. Actually, a lot of them. Let's get to crafting. I don't know. We don't really need narcotics, do we? We could just feed them narco berries and stuff. I think we'll be fine. Let's make sure that we got the most means to actually bring them down under. But I think a journeyman crossbow will be able to knock out some creatures and hopefully tame them up uh, without too much death and dying in between. But never underestimate me. Also, ooh, that's a Gallimimus saddle we got. A Mastercraft? Hold on. Is a Mastercraft like the freaking best one that you can? Dear God. Dude, doing pursuits is the greatest. We gotta find a Gallimimus, though. I wish there was a way we could track creatures. Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me if there is a way, and I'm just totally missing out on it. But the sun is beginning to rise, and I kind of... Ooh, how do we switch ammo for this? That is a great question. Can we maybe right click it again? No. Do we have to go to the inventory and drag? Is that how that works? Let's see here really quickly. We'll make, the, we'll make this... 
There we go. Okay, perfect. So the bow will be for killing things because so it shoots faster. And then this, we get more bang for our buck. Hold on, 56 damage. Actually, yeah, 56 damage. I think that's in terms of Topor. Uh, so out of curiosity, if we put that there, what's the damage looking like on that? 34. So yeah, we're going to leave this as the designated Trank ranged weapon that we have. And then we're just going to put Stone Arrows uh, over on the other one. And then that one, we can focus on killing things from a range. This one, we can whip out to be as efficient as possible with taming things. Then we got this thing for the melee. All in all, the setup's starting to look pretty good. Besides the whole like being naked thing, although I think we should be able to fix her up rather nicely. Uh, we, we can probably just repair our things, right? We don't even have to actually, oh no, those were the gloves that were getting super poopy. Oh yeah, just get those new gloves. We can finally afford those, woohoo! Gonna be looking all sorts of swagalicious now. We got like 200 Engram points too. We should probably look into what Engrams we actually want to get going a little bit and start investing those. So why don't we get to scrolling and see what looks in Tyson. Spyglass, I know for a fact, is gonna be really good. We do need to get some crystal though, which might not be the closest, but definitely that will come in handy without a doubt. Uh, other stuff here. I guess we got saddles. Probably the raptor saddle whenever we come across that. I'm guessing we want to learn like all the gun stuff. That'll probably be good. A tr There's a lot of trikes nearby. I wouldn't mind taming one up, having it help us out. Same with the raptor. Maybe use the trike as the enforcer. Raptor as our saddle so we could walk around a little bit on the faster side. Of course, we'll hopefully be crafting more metal and more picks in the future. But we just want to get the one here to start out with a schmitty and a refining forge. That's definitely some stuff to do. This alarm clock. Is this new? This has to be new to the mobile game, right? I think it has to be. That's interesting too. Kind of scrolling through here and seeing just like what appears to be new. There's stuff that we haven't seen before. Hello, Crossbow. I'd like some of you. Uh, Stego saddle. We'll, we'll, if the time comes, we'll go ahead and acquire that. I already got a Galmima saddle. Ain't even worried. Sickle, sword, diplo, and that is the level that we leave off at. 32! So everything else will come when it comes. But with all of that said and done, I think that's going to start wrapping up for this episode of Ark Survival Mobile. I am sorry that we didn't get to whip this thing out, but honestly, we are going to try and tame that Spino. I think... At least from what I'm seeing and probably guessing that hopefully that spinal is like a lower level, maybe like level 10 max. Also, hello, Bronto. Maybe I'll tame you one day. But given the kind of the journeyman air or crossbow we got plus 15 track arrows, maybe that'll be enough to take down the spinal. And then we could, we could combine that with the uh, soothing bomb or whatever we have. And maybe there'll be a spinal in our possession. If we have a spino. I'm going to be feeling very, very safe around these parts. No longer will freaking wrap. Like, we might not be able to ride it right away, but we'll have that thing nearby, making sure that nothing bad happens. And we'll probably do our best to try to get a raptor as well. But that is some shenanigans for us to dive in next time. Along with probably checking out another one of these types of stations and seeing what it does have to offer. Except, I don't know. Like, I said I want to try them all out. But like, the die studio. Eh, chef station. Actually, maybe chef station. Ooh, it has rare ingredients. Ooh. Uh, we like I said, we'll mess around with it. We'll figure it out. If there's any specific one you guys would like to see, definitely let me know. But that's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for me for now. Make sure you subscribe to the notification bell, hit to stay up to date with this series playlist down below to catch up and let me know what you guys want to see me do. And hitting that like button to let me know that you are enjoying the series and that you want to see more. But that's gonna go ahead and do it for me for now. Thank you guys a whole ton for watching. Have yourselves an awesome one, and I'll talk to you next one. See ya.